Well, hello everybody. Welcome back to another episode of GJP Games. This is your boy Guillermo. We're back to another episode of Resident Evil 4. Uh, the only reason why I'm recording on a Monday is because in the United States there is a holiday for President's Day. Uh, even though I'm not too fond of the current president, uh, we're still celebrating President's Day for all the other presidents. So, where we left off is when we saw Ada, and I think we did all this. Yeah, we saw the merchant in here, and we're going to continue. Give me one second, guys. Oh, I know this area. I don't want to be able to. This is going to be a fun moment right now. Alright, let's get this. Let's get this. So, I know this door is... Oh, okay. So, this door is closed. The only thing I can do... Oh, wait. There's a little secret room here that I almost forgot. Where is it? Is it here? Where is it? Is it here? Yeah, there we go. This is the room I'm looking for. So, I'm, if you watched my last video, I told you there's a way to get the... Um, the Broken Butterflies... Uh, broken Butterfly Magnum. And this is actually the door that leads to it. Here, there's... No, there's a... There's a vase somewhere with a snake. Nope, not this one. Alrighty. Uh, thank you. Nope. There we go. What you got for me? A regular chicken egg. Not what I wanted, but I'll take it. This door leads you back here again. You just go through here and up the stairs, and that leads you to the broken butterfly again. Alright, since I'm not gonna do that right now, I'm just gonna double back. Just wanted to show you the route. So we continue on by pressing the bell, which opens the painting, and you're supposed to shoot the wine bottle to open the door. But here's where the fun starts. So I'm going to take off the shotgun. Get jumped by people. And Mr. Wolverine guy comes around. <laughs> oh! Dead in three, two, one. I'm not whack. <laughs> oh, great. So these arches are really annoying. Anyways, so let's try that again. I think I'm back to the beginning. No, I'm back. Okay, the checkpoint is right here after the. After the wine bottle. So let's take our shotguns. Oh, I forgot I could use a shotgun, use a shotgun shell too. actually not that annoying because I am stuck in a rock and hard place so I'm gonna get a couple of deaths here no actually So 
all you do is circle around, hopefully keep them inside. And I'm dead. Oh! The time I finally got out, I'm stuck. I got killed. Oh, let's try this one more time. I know I can do this. Have patience with me, guys. Just skip a few minutes when I eventually finish this. somebody else. Always somebody messing me up. I really don't want to spend more time on this than I need to. Alright. <laughs> I had it in my fingertips. Okay. Problem one done. Alright, let us wait first. Let, let me clear out. Oops. Oh, he's inside. He's outside of me. I'm going back inside. And this is how you game the system. Why are you laughing? And... Oh, okay. So, now that I, 
I have gotten full attention of him. I shall. Since he's on, he's on the other side. He can't really touch me because he doesn't know I'm inside. Just uh, turn around. Oh, your mother! Really? Destiny, help me. I had it. I don't know why I did that. Mm. Motivation? Okay. No, you do not get up. Nope, 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 you do not get out. Okay, okay, okay. You can stay right there, you can stay right there. Oh, you yeah. mother. Stay down. Nope, nope. Where is he? Come inside, come inside. Oh, come on, how you catch me? And yeah, you're you're outside. This. <laughs> Let's go back inside. And I'm caught. Might be a good thing. I know. Come inside. I need you to come inside. Come in. Come inside. Come inside. Right here. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Okay. Now stay out. Stay inside. Wait, wait, wait. That was a fail. Hourglass, which is a uh, uh, oh no! Get out of here! Get out of here! I'm out of here. All right. So that hourglass is a treasure that you can just sell straight up. No need to. It's not a combination. Um, it's not a combination treasure. Give me one. Oh, wait, what am I doing? Wait, actually. 
out of. Oh man. It's getting low on ammo. <laughs> Don't come at me. Come on, dog. Let me get to that comment. Give me one second. Oh, another fun part. Excuse me, guys. Oh, whoops. Sorry. Oh, this is actually a part that I need you guys to pay attention because this is actually one of the parts that are is gonna really help you out. And my thing just froze. Sorry, guys. Um, so I need my sniper for this. Oh, thank you, Kenny. Uh, I'm just uh trying my best to do to play one of my favorite games. Alright, one is done. So, out of all the virus thing that comes out of the head, this one is actually the most annoying. Those fire things. Okay, he's dead. Um, they jump at you, and uh, they could get annoying when they jump at you. So try and dispose of them as quickly as possible. And I can't, so I don't have a good angle on them. So, really? I see, I think one of these guys has a shield. Yes, just pick him off right here. He said he doesn't have a shield. Okay, it was good. Thank you for that help. A shotgun, can I grab it? Yes. Thank you. Who says they see me? That pulls the bridge. Okay. Be ready, You're gonna get jumped on both sides here. So, I don't know if that's understandable. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, I'm out. Okay. Take that. Take that. 
Who's here? Oh, we got a snake. He has a metal head, so you gotta watch out. So, I should take my sniper away for him to shoot again. Take him out like that. Alright, let's continue. Oops, I killed him. Keys and treasures. Oh, there's somebody else in here. He should be somewhere around here. Probably upstairs. There we go. Oh, look at that with me. Alrighty. Now we're done with that. Now that we're clear, we could start looting. So make sure you get this. For this rocket launcher, as awesome as it may be, I highly, highly recommend you keep it for when I show you later on in the level that, be that the rocket launcher becomes very handy. If you know what I'm talking about, leave a thumbs up because uh, that's one of the secret. I mean, I don't want to say secret, but people really don't realize what you could do to defeat this boss using the rocket launcher. Hold up, let me get to the comments right now. Give me one second. I actually have to cut scene. I'll, I'll get to the... I'll get to your comments, so... I apologize. Give me one second. Alright, what do you got for me, merchant? Got some rare things on sale, stranger. Alright, stranger. What are you selling? Press us all. Is that all, uh, stranger? Is that all? <laughs> Thank right. you. Um, chicken egg spinal. Is that all? <laughs> is that all? Blue. Is that all? <laughs> Thank you. Uh, need another green eye for the butterfly lamp, red gem, purple gem, elegant mask. I need one more gem, hourglass. Uh, I'll buy it at a high price. <laughs> Thank you. Right. What are you buying? Ooh, attaché case X. Is that all? <laughs> buy that in an Thank instant. You. Give you way more space. All right, do we have anything else? No. Uh, tune up. What are you buying? Nope. Okay, we're done here. Alright, I'll get to your comments right now, guys. Leon! I got it! Ooh! Oh! Ooh, that's a horrible little guy. Ugh. I don't know how he's still alive from that. Oh, it's nasty. Oh, that comes from under your, sh under your thing. Now that I have the sample, you serve me no purpose. Sadler! My boy Salazar will make sure you follow the same fate. Oh, really? We'll see about that. Stay with me, Lewis. I am a researcher, hired by Sadler. He found out what I was up to. <laughs> Don't talk. Here. It should suppress growth of the parasite. The sample. Sadler took it. You have to get it back. Oh, yes. man. Man, I'm pretty sure he's like, man, you, you're yelling a little too much, man. Oh, poor Lewis. He was one of my favorite characters. Alrighty, end of chapter 3-3. Three, three, and then now to 3-4, which is probably one of the most annoying levels. Or one of the annoying parts of this game. Oh, hello there. It's Ashley. Help! 
Silent pitcher always has 5,000 pesetas behind it. No! Oh my lord. Oh wait, let me check what he's- I forgot what he says. They'll pay for your death, I promise. You know, I don't want to save Ashley. I just want to run away. Forget you, Ashley. Bye, Ashley. No! Can't leave Ashley behind. Oh, darn it. Uh, I tried. Alright, so take care of your sniper. And carefully aim for the metal parts. So what I do is aim for the top parts. Because once you shoot the top two, she bends over and she becomes less of a target to shoot another piece. All right, Iceman Games. Talk about near-death experience. Oh, great. Ashley, get out of there! Yeah, I should get out of there. Oh. Five seconds ago. Nice bars. So the red guys always summon more zombies, so always take them out first. I'll try this once more. Oh, I gotta get all the things. Oh. Hey. So that's why you gotta make sure you finish this on the first try because restarting this becomes tedious. Yes, I know. You need help. Saying that like 20 times already. Help! Oh, yeah. Sniper. So, there's been a couple of times where I shot Ashley by accident back in the GameCube days. Me being all nonchalant and think I'm mad cool with my, with my shooting skills. But, yeah. That's besides the point. Talk about. Oh, yeah, we already saw that. Okay, dokes, let's try this again, shall we? And you know. And you're done. Oh, come on. That was a headshot. And you're done. Always reload. Do I have a grenade? Yes, I do. Should incendiary though. Hurry up. 
So this is the one and only time you're able to control Ashley, which is kind of cool, but kind of annoying as well, because uh, Ashley's quite defenseless. Anyways. So you, uh, Ashley is very good at collecting stuff too, so make sure you just collect stuff. Um, now this part of the game, the, the Plagas guys are here too. But the goal of the game is to bob and weave around them. It could be quite annoying too. And then what you do is come to these... Wow. Okay, nope, nope. Okay. What I do is bob and weave them under the table. So, have him come around. Have him come all the way till he's about to grab you. And then just spend your time to do this until you get up. And then when you hear him close enough again, you to wash repeat. As annoying and tedious that may be. And then you don't have to raise it all the way to the top. I think, I'm sure you could do it just enough to where you're tall enough to get through. I think I just need a little bit more. That's good enough. I'm sure that's good enough. I may be wrong. And I just want to get this. And I'm... Yep, see? And then you just... What I do, which is kind of interesting too, get the attention of these guys here. I think... Um, their attention. We toss this. Then we could do also. <laughs> I'm gonna come all the way around. Where's the other one? And I didn't want to do that. And I missed. See, that's why I didn't want to do that. I wanted to crawl, but he grabbed the thing. Pissed me off. <laughs> Oops, nope, he ain't getting me. No, down. Now them together. Really? Are you for real, Ashley? You really don't know how to throw. Oh, that's what I'm The other one. There we go. And they dropped nothing. Wow. Did all that for nothing. Anyways. Now you just go venturing and finding more stuff. In peace and calm and nobody chasing after you. Nothing here. Again, just get it all the way to the top above right there. That's perfect because that's Ashley's height, and then this one as well. You don't need to get it so wide, Ashley's not that fat. Let's just get it like halfway. Wow, Ashley is fat. Anyways, just do a little bit more. You just walk right through. Anyways, okay. Oh, is there another one guy? There's another guy here. Wait, first. Um, you come into this room in the end, but you can go in here to collect all the stuff that's inside. And Kenny, the reason you... Thank you for saying that I play good, but the only reason why I play good is because I play this like 20 times in the, in the GameCube. All right, Butler's memo. Knowing that Sir Nior Ramon Salazar has no family, Lord Salar must have used his strong faith in the Los Illuminados to his advantage to talk that Senor Salazar into doing the seal of, la, of the Las Plagas once 
done by his ancestors. Senor Salazar would never do such a thing unless he was in the same way being used unknowingly. I should have sensed that the Lord's dirty scheme sooner. I feel that I'm partly responsible for all this. I have, I have no idea what, as what the Lord is planning, but Senor Salazar is just being used. I know it's too late now. However, Senor Salazar has already taken the plaga into his old blo into his own body. There is no turning back once La Plaga has turned into a dolt in the body. La Plaga parasite does not die un unless the host dies. There is no cure. Perhaps Senor Salazar may have been vaguely aware of the Lord's plan all along, but it's hard to tell. Nonetheless, there there is nothing I can do about it now. I have severed the Salazar family for generate. I have served the Salazar family for generation. I am prepared to continue my services until the very end. That's a very good butler. All right, so this, huh? Wait a second. There's a round hole in the center. So we gotta, that's we gotta, um, find that little round piece that goes in there. That allows us to exit this place. But with that, we need to go this way. Here's the fun part. Okay, first you do you push this. Press this button. And you go for entry and off and see what else you can find. Okay, you got a green herb here. Alright. Press this button all the way in the end. Alright. And now you press the button in the center. Where are you? It opens both doors front and back. Wait, no. Oh, then you push the button again. Pick this up while you're at it. Stone tablet. I'll show you where that comes into play. Alright. That's the side door, and now you have the front and back doors open. Alright. There should be something around here. Some money. Okie dokes, let us continue. Spinal. Whoa. Hello, knights and my knights in shining armors. They look conspicuously, conspicuously sitting there for no reason. Alright. Oh, cool. Guys just stand there. Alright, looks like the pieces of form a symbol of some sort, but I can't really tell. Rearrange the pieces. Okay, the p this is a very simple puzzle if you can figure it out. This looks like a centerpiece, so take that into the center. And what you can see is that this is the top left and this is the top right. But this is also the head, so that's the center. So you move that up. If you move this one in the corner, it moves both pieces. If you move this one, you move both pieces. Oh, it looks like the shape is coming to form. Move that. Move that. Almost. There we go. There's still a piece missing. So, that's where the stone tablet comes into play. Place the stone tablet. You place the stone tablet and the piece is complete and the door opens. So, go into the next room. Scavenge everything you can find in the room before continuing. Cold bangle. Alright, got a spinal here. Alright, this is the center dial thing that we were looking for, the Salazar family insignia. And we have a treasure chest, what may this be? Doors closed until we pick this up. We got the serpent ornament. What is that? Oh, hex no. Oh, hex no. Step back, step back. Oh, hex no. We gotta run. Just gotta run. Actually can't do anything. We gotta run. Oh heck no, what's this? Oh I pressed L1 R1. I'm smart. And it goes to show you that I actually can't take a hit. Anyways. Alright, let's try this again. What I do is just wait for the three knights to come around, then you just like circle around them very easily. They're very slow moving. I'm 
you can usually just run away from them. It's just this part that you need to watch out for. Nope, she just drifts backwards. Alright. Then one more. Alright, see the thing is with the PS4, PS3, the PlayStation controllers, you have two, sh two sets of shoulder buttons. With the GameCube, we just had L and R. So it was easy to do the shoulder button combination because it's just L and R. For this game, it's L1, R1 or L2, R2. So that's why I got confused with the first time around. Alright, so let's get out of here. Huh? Wait a sec, there's a round hole in the center. That's where you put the uh, Salazar family insignia. Now I can turn this thing. So, turn it, yes. And we so reveal some ladders. And a good shot of our butt. Got some money here before we leave. And we are done with this place. Uh, such a long hallway. This is really not necessary. Anyways, you unlocked it. Leon. Ashley. <laughs> you did good. I'm sorry if I was. Oh, don't worry about it. Come on, let's move on. Alrighty. End of chapter. Now we're going to four one. Ooh, 93% hit ratio, that's good. I died two times? Surprising. Thought I died more than that. Alright, oh, whoops, I didn't want to save. Sure, whatever. Right, you have received some items from Ashley, so we'll combine this with, with this. Keep that there. Move this. There. And we'll move this here. Alrighty, so let's do a little more rearranging here. Do that here. Here, and that there. Looks a little neater. Alright. Alright, cool. What a touching moment we have here. All spoiled thanks to your interruption. Why don't you do us all a favor and leave before the audience gets pissed off? <laughs> You're nothing but an extra in my script, so don't get too carried away. Your biggest scene is over. For being a part of your crappy script. Well then, why don't you show me what a first class script is like through your own actions? Alrighty, so you want to see my actions? Let's get out of here. And I'll show. Oh wait, wait, wait! Before we leave, Whew, almost forgot. Can't get me with that. Remember what I said about the broken butterfly? This is your moment. And yeah, Lewis is still dead. All right, let's go back. It's a lot of backtracking, but it's worth it. If you want some free money, or if you want a free magnet gun. Okay, just run. Wait. That doesn't go through, I was about to say. Oh, your mother, who? Who are you here? Okay, they're gonna stay there. That's it, nope, nobody. Wow, what a waste. right there actually and they only give me money that's nice actually no I don't have much sniper ammo and I might need it in the future right, come at me dog I 
down the side. We go and we're done so now we continue wait there's a thing here no nope, i did that i thought there was uh anyways forget it okay once you go through the door stay put usually they're supposed to be the buggy buggy things but i guess they're not here i don't know why so just take it with a grain of salt and just run up and around right, uh, activate the door thing by the conversation saying that you can't get up there you got your help you should piggyback <laughs> And she unlocks it. Good job, Ashley. So now get your loot. It's not only the pistol. You got some money. You got a tr you got a treasure. Get a red herb, which is always good. Got your broken butterfly. And this perfume bottle, which is a treasure. Elegant perfume bottle is a treasure that um, you can sell. No need to combine it with anything. I know. I'm not dumb. Alright. Alright guys, give me one second. If you want, just skip like three minutes.
All right, guys, I'm back. Blame Destiny. So hopefully you skipped three minutes, or you stuck around. You guys are troopers. I give you a thumbs up. Yeah, I know you can't see it, but yeah, I give you a thumbs up. Uh, but yeah. So we got in our broken butterfly, and we are back to where we first was. Since I'm not much of a Magnum guy, I will sell this broken rare. butterfly. What are you selling? If you sell the broken butterfly, you get a good a nineteen thousand percent dice. I'll buy it at a high price. <laughs> All right. Wait, are you still selling the same thing? What are you buying? Yeah. Okay. Now we can continue forward to what we were doing. Alright. Oh, it's this part. Uh, okay. So, break these vases. Get this. Ammo? There's Wait only here. space for one, Ashley. Sorry, you gotta stay. All right, this is a pretty cool section of the game, in my opinion. So these little dragon statue things always house a Laga, one of those monk guys, to control the fire-breathing dragon statue. So. What you could do is, if you're good enough or lucky enough, you can catch one of these guys off guard. And you catch him before he even gets you. This one's easy. And that brings up your first treasure box. The other one is over here. Easily catch him if you have some patience. Let the thing swing back in the other direction. No, it doesn't. To the guy. Actually, I could retry. So, I apologize. But I will do this so I can show you. That's if you're quick. If you want to deal with them, you have to shoot at the metal cables that are on top. You'll see when I uh, fight the third. So this has money. Oh, he bobbled weave. He can't bobble weave this suplex. Suplex 
big city. Oh. Who's next? Oh, he's just come on, come on. Ready? Oh, he died. Want another one? This is the goat of life. Alright, then you just gotta backtrack all the way back to the beginning. Alright, make the opening, jump across, take this opening and jump across. And then you go back to the beginning. Have any vases? No. All right, these have the vases. A nice little car ride. All right. Nope. All right, shotgun ammo. Always want shotgun ammo. You unlocked it. So remember that purple gem that was hiding on the wall? This is, would naturally be the way you get it. But you, like the way I showed you in the last video, there's a way to get it easier, faster. All right, so sorry for the little mute moment right there. Destiny's little brother and sister are being chatty, so I know you guys don't want to hear that. All right, let's continue. Oh, what is this? Oh, is this part, okay. No, it's not this part. Okay, sorry, I got confused. But I do know another part that I need the rock launcher for. I don't know if it's here or later. No, actually needs to be taken. So it's not here yet. Alright, so let's continue. Alright, the bar's right here. I forgot where to go. Okay, let me go here because I know there's a yellow herb here. And this note. Alright, sample retrieved. As you may have heard, Louis Sarah has been disposed by Lord Salad. The sample is back where it belongs. I hope that the whole matter could be resolved without troubling the Lord Harver. As long as the sample is safe, we can all rejoice, for our time is nearly at hand. Now that the sample is back in our safe hands, it is a bit more difficult for the troublesome woman to get it. In light of all this, it is unfortunate that Sarah had to go. Like us, he would have been a bright he would have had a bright future if he had shown more faith in our beliefs. As for the other two Americans, the Lord has left matters into the, our hands. We must not disappoint the Lord. We shall capture Ashley and take her as to the Lord as and dispose of the American agent. Alright. So Ahead, I think it's this door that you're supposed to put the king and queen grail uh, on it. So we shall deal with that first. Wait. Oh no, it's this way. Oh, good. This treasure, I need. I'll show you. 
what this treasure is. So the green gem completes the elegant mask. We see the merchant again, I'll deal with that. So this is what I'm speaking about. So to open this door to continue the story, you need a Queen's Grail, a King's Grail, which I will show how to get that, which could be frustrating. So bear with me. Follow me. Oh, this is a fun part. So here is a little bit of chess, I guess you call it. Move these two statues here and here. Here and then have Ashley wait over here. Wait. While you wait here. There's a door. Now I'll have Ashley come. I think you've lived long enough. Let's see if you can survive this time. What? See these coming down. And there's spikes! No, Ashley, what would we do? What would we do, Ashley? Oh, let's go the lights. Wow, Ashley. Didn't have to be so paranoid. Just, you know, figure things out. Alright, so, let's continue. Pull out your sniper. You shall see why. Of course, the door will close on her. Oh no. Big drill machine. Let's kill the drivers. thing is just stuck there. Alright, that's it. And we're out of here. And we're back to where we started. Now off to the King's Grail. Um, King's Grail I think is this way. Wait, there's a... Uh, the merchant's around here somewhere. There he is. Anything else here? Is that all? <laughs> is that all? <laughs> oh, not Thank guy. you. Uh, a mask. I'll buy it at a high price. <laughs> is that all? Not as pendant. I'll buy it at a high price. <laughs> just uh, for I'll buy it at a high price. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, I'll get perfume uh, bottle. I'll buy it at a high price. <laughs> That's Thank it. you. Turn what up. are you buying? We turn it up here. Shotgun. Is that all? <laughs> Is that all? <laughs> Thank you. That's you. it. That's it. Come back any time. All right. I'm satisfied with that. I think the king's rail is this way. All righty. Wait. Have Ashley wait there. You'll see why. It'll be better. Less headaches. 
So, oh, we got these knights positioned uh, the way. Look at them fidgeting. And I, I see you. Oh, it's L2, R2. I did it again. Oh, else. Now, first things first, let me use the chicken egg, get it out of the way. Loot your areas, take out your shotgun of choice, because you will need it. Take the king's rail, may, may the wrath of evil befall on the one who disturbs the whole, this holy grail. Take the king's rail? Of course! Why would I want to disturb the place? Alright, so we got our knight in shining armor. So, if you have flash grenades, this would be very useful. So, oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. So the strategy that I'm trying to pull here is to pop all three of their heads. If I pop Wait. all three of their heads, I can use a flash grenade, which I have plenty of. Um, using the flash grenades, I could destroy all three of them at the same time, which saves ammo for me. So we shall try that again. Do I have enough shotgun ammo? Do I have shotgun, shotgun ammo to go around for days. So let's just go for the start. All three of them are gone. Are up. Up. Oh. Nice. Okay. Ammo. Er. Ammo. Next round. So these are the head biting ones, so please use caution while you make attempt to miss. So once you get them done, that's it. Just two sets of uh, knights, and you're done. So now that I'm done with this and I could relax and my heart could stop racing, uh, I will collect what I need to collect and get out of here. Where's my herb? Right here. And let's get out of here. Everybody safe? No one got hurt. Oh, comments. Wait, sorry. Give me a second. Oh, Iceman Games back. Yeah. So I just got the King's King Grail and the Queen Grail. If you remember that. Oh wait, it's this part. I think it's this part. Wait. Actually, wait. Yes, I knew it. Okay, so you got some friends here that are just waiting for you to put the King Grail and the Queen Grail back on the thing. So shoot his head off. Shoot his head off. And wait, does this one have a thing? No, he could die. No, no, no. They're getting too close. We gotta launch that thing. I'm so mad. And I'm at. Yeah, you can't throw you can't get back that. Wait, throw that, throw that. Yeah, you can't do that. Super Black City. Pop. Oh, wow. Alright, Alright. Oh, Ashley's there. 
Don't go for Ashley, please. Oh, great. Um, um, we went for Ashley. Let's go, let's go. Run, run, run. Run, run, run. Run, run, run. Run, run, run. No! Darn it. I knew that was a bad idea. Let's try it again. Wait. Actually, stay all the way back here, please. Those... No, I still don't have ammo. I shouldn't be wasting that. I just realized that. Alrighty, where am I going? Yeah, man. I just realized what I did, like, halfway through. I realized that, you know... That instead of the guy, the monk chasing me, he can chase Ashley too. I'm like, wait, why is he not following me? I'm like, oh no, I'm done. So yeah, that totally happened. Get down. Get down. Get down. Get down. Oh, great. Throw it, throw it, I dare you. Nope. Throw it, I dare you. Nope. Suplex City. Oh, get, yo, why are you so close to me? Suplex City. Wait, nope, 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 I'm not doing that again. Oh yeah, the armor, the Ashley's armor costume, yeah, is the best, but yeah, you gotta unlock it first. So, you gotta deal with this for now. Alright, and then that opens the door. And you come in. Alright, so I'm almost done, Destiny. Hold up. Hey, rifle ammo. Something I need. Put a snake in here. Drug it. Oh, chicken eggs. I don't need chicken eggs. Alright. So, instead of walking through the doors, notice that there's broken windows here. Jump over the broken window, climb up the ladder. I think this has a spinal in it. No, no, no. Alright, so as you come along here, you have your second butterfly limb. So that's Wait. why you need to keep those eyes. Uh, this is the little hive things for all the bugs to shoot with your handgun or whatever, whatever type of ammo. It'll eventually fall down. There we go. Jump down. Where right, actually come here? Where are you? Follow me. All right. Then this should be a cutscene. And let's have some fun. Hey, before the cutscene starts, buy your shotgun, get it ready. Oh, so this is how these bugs look like. Oh, Ashley, no. Ashley! No, Ashley. Great. More yeah. Yep. A lot more though. Yes, a lot more. So get ready. So what I do is hide at the door. Sometimes it's a good idea, sometimes it's a bad idea, and just fire away. Sometimes it's a good idea, sometimes it's not a good idea, sometimes get caught. 
Always I love to jump for some reason. So this is the last opportunity for you to get a blue eye. So see, I got a blue eye there. So hopefully there's a blue eye on the floor. Oh no, there's there's more opportunities. But in this, for the next while, you won't get another opportunity for a blue eye. Oh good, two blue eyes. So, in the game there's only two butterfly lamps. So if you are lucky enough to get two blue eyes, um, you have completed the set for the treasures and you can sell them off to the, to the merchant. Um, there is one more opportunity for bugs to appear and that's later on, I think in chapter 4. Um, where you are in a cave full of them. And that's your last chance. Right? Shoot those two braces, the bridge falls. Save station right there. I'm gonna save it right here, guys. Let me go to the Welcome. Oh, wait, I need to combine my thing. Got some rare things on sale, stranger. Cut. Let me uh treasure. It's a red eye. Nope, that has the red eye ready. There we go, so two butterfly lamps with the, all three pieces right. together. And then now what you can you sell selling? them. If I have anything I don't need. Let's see. Oh, is that old? Green eyes, I don't need them anymore. Red eyes, I don't need them anymore. The butterfly Thank lamps, ah, I can sell them both. I'll buy it at a high price. <laughs> Thank that's it. You. What are Soon you up. buying? Red nine. Is that old? <laughs> is that... <laughs> Thank you. And the rifle. Yes. Is that old? <laughs> is that... <laughs> that's Thank you. Alright, so let me save. And finish it off here and then continue on later on in the future. So thank you guys for watching. If you saw like what you saw, definitely give a thumbs up. Uh, subscribe to the channel if you haven't. Um, definitely posting more videos of Resident Evil 4 among other videos. Um, if you want, you can check out my other videos. I have other games that I'm playing as well. So, um, yeah. Before I leave, uh, peace out, um, Iceman. Um, I'll check you guys. I'll check you later. Uh, before I leave, let me give you the verse of the day. Uh, today's verse comes from Psalms 37.5, which is, Commit your ways to the Lord, trust in Him, and He will do this. Uh, let me see what else that says, because I, I want to see what it's... Um, uh, so, commit to your way to the Lord, trust, him in, trust in Him, and He will do this. He will make your righteous rewards shine like, like the dawn, your vindication like the noonday sun. Switch it to the message version, because I want a better translation of that. Oh, so in the message version, it says, um, he'll validate your life in the clear light of day and stamp you with approval at high noon. So, to me, it's saying that, you know, if you believe in God and trust in his ways, um, he will make your your path right and you know you you know you're going to be doing the right thing um because he'll show you the way of righteousness as the verse says and you'll be stamped as in the sense that you know god will be god will be with you and then when you go to heaven he'll know that you've done good right so i think that's my translation of how i understand this verse um if you know leave a comment if you have your thoughts about it and with that i'll bid you guys adieu I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.